Maidan, where the authoritarian regime falls, and we have such a window of opportunity to change something for better. We was uh, involved in uh, reforming of police. I was one of people who uh, elaborated the program of human rights. When you police came to become a policeman, they have passed through this program. We even trained the first wave of such kind of policemen. And it was like a very um, interesting period. I tried to avoid police on the street and some period they say, uh, Alexandra, hello. <laughs> I try to give them like um, understanding that police uh, is uh, a very sinful profession. So you have very quickly understand situation and uh, take a decision. And that's why my task and task of other my colleagues was to give them this ground for this decision. Uh, international standards, uh, decision of European court, we try to analyze some cases, uh, to discuss some examples, to ingrain in the uh, police uh, daily activities this uh, thinking ability, <laughs> what is human right is and how they has to protect them. Some of them escaped to Russia, some of them escaped to uh, occupied part of Donbas to avoid justice, uh, and some of them still remain on their position. They are not called like Berkuts, they, they, but uh, like the, this Berkut guard was, uh, um, was liquidated, but people still here, some people still here. This is a problem. This is a question to our effectiveness of investigation of crimes which she committed during the Euromaidan. The lawyers of people who, of, of relatives of people who were killed on, during Maidan events, try to push this investigation. And unfortunately, I personal don't uh, see the great interest from the top official. And without result, we couldn't go further. We couldn't build democratic state without this uh, law answer to this uh, dramatic and uh, very um, important event which was held during these three months. Uh, unfortunately, there are a lot of things which Ukraine has to done to have effective police. So it's only beginning of the way, not even the middle. Our security service like was a branch of FSB. That's why uh, this um, transformation after Euromaidan, it's uh, very difficult because we have to restore the not only human rights spirit in these uh, bodies, but uh, to, to find a people who uh, will work uh, properly for interest of Ukrainian people, not for interest of Putin.